Let's see. You all are coming back. Alice, I'm going to give you the last word because down through the years, you've pinned my ears back pretty good. Many times you've been right. What's your response to Mr. Forbes and Mr. Laffer? My response is that the financial markets are crybabies. Uh, a lot of people made a lot of bad decisions, and now they want the Fed to bail them out. And that's not the Fed's role. That's your guide, Alice. I was waiting for also, that. that is worth the, right there, that is worth the price of admission it to is. hear Alice say that. That's great. That's a good thing. No. Alice Rivlin, I'm going to give you the last word, Alice Rivlin. <clears throat> did the Federal Reserve, the nation's central bank, did it leave the Wall Street bride at the altar today? Is that what really happened? I think the Wall Street bride should have been left at the altar. <laughs> the Fed ought to f concentrate on the real economy, and the real economy is not in bad shape. Not in bad. I actually agree with you. But what about these credit market clog-ups, Alice? In all seriousness, commercial paper ain't working, LIBOR ain't working. Doesn't that bother you? Firms need money. It does bother me, but it's not clear to me that the Fed can fix it with all of this uh, cheap money and uh, easy populism that uh, you guys seem to favor. Uh, this might make the situation in the long run worse. Our laugher, you've been called a cheap money populist. What do you think of that? <laughs> I'd rather be I'd, I'd rather be Steve's drunk fat guy on the operating table. <laughs>